right, guys, we are back for another Dokkan battle video. So, King Cold um, has got his Super Strike Awakening and EZA. Um, <clears throat> I do think this is a good one for people to do. I think that this King Cold can actually be fairly effective um, in some Super Battle Road stages. In particular, I think a couple of Super Battle Road stages that only just recently came out, I think this King Cold could actually be a pretty decent um, unit for um, oh, actually, let me take a look at the, um, uh, event info here. So, we, of course, have, you know, King Cold's, you know, Super Strike revamp. The first stage gets you his unit. Second stage gets you the Metal Swaken on the SSR. Then third stage, Metal Swaken on the TUR. And then, of course, the last stage is where you can EZA him. Um, let me see. Oh, oh, his typings. So, he goes physical, tech, and then physical again. Okay, so... I guess the tech phase is to lock down um, AGL trunks. That would make sense. Because um, that's probably the, the team we'll use to uh, do as easy and stuff like that. Um, and then time travelers is the category that will get you the extra drops here. If we switch over real fast, um, we could take a look right here. So what we're going to want to do in these stages later on... Um, we're going to want to use Super Saiyan Trunks Future, so like LR, Physical Super Saiyan Trunks, right there, right? Um, or, uh, we want to, well, actually, no, no, Super Saiyan Trunks Future, that's not Physical LR Trunks, so we're going to bring it up in a second. And then, uh, it wants you to use a, a Time Traveler category team for Stage 4. Yeah, dude, Super Saiyan Trunks Future, that's like Dragon Ball Super Trunks. It's Super Saiyan Trunks Teen that's um the physical lr trunks right yeah here trunks super saiyan trunks team that's this one and then future um is essentially the dragon ball super trunks one so we'll just bring both whatever it's not a big i mean the the team i'm gonna uh run anyway right um is this one right here wh which has both because this guy right here is super saiyan trunks future and then this guy is super saiyan trunks team right so we have both on there um we'll, we'll go ahead and do this we're gonna rock this um uh, EGL Trunks led team right here. Is there? There's probably not EGL Trunkses on the. Yeah, friends list. Not shocking. What about High uh, Ultimate Gohan? I've got like one. Oh, brother. Let's just bring like Spirit Pump Goku. Okay. <laughs> yeah, friend system. Uh, and you know, hey, hey, man, listen. Any day now, that friend system update's got to be coming in. Oh my God, look at this. This is the way. <laughs> these fights used to be i'm gonna we're gonna do auto for a little bit now in these super strike videos that i do i do like to get all of the missions done um so that's why we're gonna do stage one we'll do stage two then we'll do stage three and four uh can i get anything besides ones please but look at the way these maps used to be dude like th this used to be insanity this is what all of these used to look like right give me oh my please okay i was like just, I, I don't need to fight all of these Frieza soldiers right here. Because I don't, like, all all the characters on this team right here we have, I've, they've got fully Link leveled. It's like, this is the type of stage that potentially could be good for, like, Link leveling or something like that. But the thing about that is, remember, there's a couple different factors when it comes to Link leveling. You want, first and foremost... Um, you definitely want a stage that has a lot of stop signs because I mean people are gonna want to auto link level right you're not gonna want to just jump in and manually do that all day every day right so you want to fight with a lot of stop signs um you also would like a fight potentially with a lot of only stop sign fights right um because once you have a lot of like non stop sign fights then you're probably going to be missing a lot of link levels when they're on the actual stage, right? That That's one thing a lot of people don't realize. Um, then on top of that, uh, you want to make sure that the link level rate of the stage is, is good. A lot of times the events, like like the, um, you know, the story events and strike events, stuff like that, the, the link level rate is not as good, right? So like one of the big, like back when link leveling was first a thing, um, everyone was trying out the, uh, the Raditz story event where there's just like a, a, a like flood of a billion, um, whatchamacallits, um, there, there was just like a, a thousand, like, uh, Cybermen in, in a row, but that was before we knew that the, the link levels are predetermined when you enter the fight as well, right? Because that's not the case. 
I'm probably going to save that ultimate Gohan for when we do Sage 4. Uh, I don't know. I, I guess I'm, I'm just going to bring a, a Thousand Day Goku, right? That, that, that'll that be fine. Whatever. Um, I got, We could probably bring like a Tech Ultimate Gohan as well, but it's whatever. <laughs> no AGL Chunks is on the friends list. Not a shock, right? Uh, a lot of these leaders that they dropped just before the 200% meta, like, are just completely dead. Like, no one no one cares about running a lot of these characters. Like, Physical Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Kid Buu, AGL Trunks, Tech Kill, and Khalifla, right? Like, those characters as leaders, I think, could potentially be good um, in, like, you know, super battle road stages and stuff like that. But, like, no one is running them. Um, the friend says that, like, there's just... How many, like, legitimate, like, lead-type units are there? Whoa, the cord. What was that? Okay, weird. Cord, hello? That was a, a weird one. The cord usually doesn't disconnect like that. Okay, we're back. We're back. We're back. <laughs> cord issues, of course. Um, Damn it. What was I saying? I can't remember. I, I've lost. I've, I've completely lost whatever my... Oh, oh, leaders. Yeah. There's just so many different, like, category leaders and stuff like that that they've introduced, right? Because remember, we were in the category... I still see people, like, incorrectly saying, Oh my god, I hate the red zone when it's 200% leader skills, which many people still don't understand, right? But um, it, we had the same meta for five years, right? 2017 until the start of 2022, it was just 150% to 170% category leader skills. That's all it was. Now, for the first time since 2017, um, <clears throat> we're taking a step up into the 200% leader skill meta, right? So, uh, there's just five years of, like, care like EZAs, Dokkan Fests, LRs that have, like, very relative leader skills. So, the friends list just becomes a mess. And then, I don't know if it, I'm sure it's like this on Global as well, but on JP... There's a lot of people, they just put, like, their favorite unit as, like, the friend lead, right? Like, I see a lot of, I feel like I see a lot of LR, Kale, and Khaliflas, um, despite the fact that they're obviously a very shit leader, um, but it's just, like, you know, people like that character, right? Or, you know, you see, like, remember, for years, LR, STR, Vegito Blue was the, the very, very big annoying one. You would see LR, STR, VB everywhere, constantly. All right, future trunks. Oh, yeah, we could we could bring the trunks in my. That's um, what you call it? They're a, a, a time traveler buff. Um, here, let's go ahead and bring a uh, no, we'll bring a Vegeta and Bra right there to get us a couple of extra medals. All right, so we did stage one, we did stage two. Yeah, dude, look at the difference in the stage, right? Like we just stage one and two were these huge sprawling labyrinths, right? And then we jump into this stage, and it's just like the small little path, right? This is the update, you know, back because the, the King Cold Super Strike, I believe, is one of the earlier Super Strikes, right? Which is why it's just a nightmare looking at that. You know, you got Frieza soldier fights everywhere and shit like that. Um, so, like, now we do a, a sort of like a modern day stage. Where it's just like a quick straight line and we're done. It's, you know, Do Dokkan has made a lot of improvements in a lot of different ways throughout the years, for sure. I just realized this LR Physical Trunks is, I mean, we're going up against Wicked Bloodline. He's going to be doing guaranteed crits in this fight, huh? Against this uh, King Cold right here. Pretty sure this boy's going to be guaranteed critting. Um, yeah, he gets five key and a guaranteed crit against a Wicked Bloodline category enemy. So Trunks is going to be cutting this stage up. That's going to be beautiful. Okay, so now we go on to the last stage. Remember, it wants to see you Super Saiyan Trunks' future on the team, which I, 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 I wonder if that's, like, not correct. And it's actually Super Saiyan Trunks' team. Just because, remember, Super Saiyan Trunks' future, those are uh, the Trunks's that fight in Dragon Ball Super, and then the Trunks that fights in the future uh, kills the androids and kills First Form Cell. Those are Super Saiyan Trunks' future. The one that kills King Cold is Super Saiyan Trunks' team. So, I, I'm, I'm just going to bring both, right? I feel like this is the best way to go about this. Um, I think, uh, no, I, I think I do, I do want to bring the future Gohan. Or, uh, excuse me, the, um, ult ultimate Gohan is who I want to bring for this one right here. Uh, we'll go ahead and do this no item. Oh, how many, what are, how many turns do we have to do this in? 
We have to do this in five turns. Yeah, five turns right here. Easy. Okay. So let, let's go. I, I like to do this. I like to get all the missions done in one try. So we have to use the trunks. We have to get it done within five turns. Um, and then, of course, we have to... Um, we'll, we'll, we'll be all right right here. We'll, we'll take this down. Um, with the trunks, time traveler team, and under five turns, right? Shouldn't be really too bad right here. Um, okay. So, first phase is physical. Second phase was tech. Oh, he seals, huh? This is not a problem. I, we, we should, even with no links activated right here, I think we should be good. Oh, we're gonna have a really, yeah, th this is pretty good. Okay, so King Cold seals, though. That potentially could be a pain, right? Like, if he would have sealed this trunks right here. Like this, because again, he's doing guaranteed crit right here. Is this a one shot? No, but he got him low enough. Um, I think that the STR um, Broly movie trunks should be able to finish him off. This Broly movie trunks, who's pretty solid right here. We should be good right here. Can you? Uh, yeah. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Right there. Okay. Um, are you sealing again? We might not finish this one off in one phase. Oh, he seals two. Okay. Hmm. Um, well, the good news is that AGL Trunks, that doesn't really hurt him so much, right? Um, because he, he still got a lot of crits. He potentially could do a lot of damage and stuff like that. Uh-oh. Th this, uh, I, dude, I got to get these missions done. If he's going to seal multiple characters like this. The good news is that as long as we can keep physical Trunks uh, able to crit like that, like once we get to you know the last phase we should be good wait was gohan guarding if he was guarding he could triple super attack right here he was oh we could still yeah agl trunks my agl trunks has got full crit of course there we go nice one more at least give me one more normal yeah boom even with the double seal nice okay 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 Beautiful, beautiful. All right, so now we're on to King Cold right here. Oh, are you kidding me? Ah, it sucks. He's still going to do a guaranteed crit, though. We have three turns to finish him off with the double seal. Dude, this guy double seal. Could you imagine a red zone boss like this? Double seal? This would be insanity a red zone boss that would be double the additional is nice because it's memories guaranteed critting that would be crazy a red zone boss that double seals this this potentially could take a couple of tries oh okay unless we're gonna get lucky with the additionals yeah beating this in five turns when he's just double sealing you every turn could be really annoying i think we're gonna be good though because ultimate gohan is gonna have all of his additionals regardless um, cause remember, I mean, Ultimate Gohan already had his guard, so he's got it up, but. Oh, we only sealed one character here. <laughs> oh, okay. We'll just do this. GG. Okay, so I guess it, sometimes he could seal two, sometimes he'll seal one. A double seal is really annoying. That's a powerful, dude, they could make a nasty, like, red zone style boss out of double sealing you holy shit that is a real annoyance right there <laughs> double seal all right man whatever a <laughs> double seal okay um so I, I guess i should mention this right um what i'm doing now with these super strikes i've already got all like i already like link level 10 to, like all the super strikes and stuff like that i've already got all of them previously rainbowed link level 10 blah 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 the ssrs so what I'm going to do is we're going to farm up a completely new copy of King Cold, right? So if we back out... Oh, yep, there's the title you get for beating the new stage. Cool, cool. But if we go take a look right here, um, I have already previously rainbowed this guy and got him to link level 10. So I'm going to farm up just a brand new copy um, to awaken to his TUR and stuff like that. So let me grab all the missions... Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and, you know, get a lot of the resources necessary for us to um, awaken him and easy him. And we'll get that in here at the end of the video. Because I do like to do, um, whatchamacallit, uh, all missions within these videos as well. Right. I think that's important to get 
So let's go ahead and grab all 17 of these. We'll get some EZA medals. I think some more copies of King Cold and stuff like that. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Okay. Um, some potential orbs as well. Nice, nice, nice. All right. So let me come back once I've, you know, gotten all the missions done. We've grinded this up. We'll awaken King Cold to TUR and get him easy aid and all the good stuff. All right, guys. So we should be good to go. Let's go ahead and rainbow um, the new King Cold that I have uh, grinded up right here. So we can go ahead and rainbow him. There we go. Um, let's go ahead and now Dokkan awaken him to his new TUR form. Um, and once we have him at his TUR form, we can also, uh, fully easy a him. Again, I think that this King Cold actually can be a fairly capable... No! <clears throat> Not during the Dokkan Awakening. <clears throat> Alright, hurry up, Dokkan. Um, but I think that this King Cold can actually be a, a fairly capable unit, um, for some Super Battle Road Sages, right? Especially a bunch of Super Battle Road Sages that just came out. Um, you know, um, Android Slash Cell Saga... Terrifying Conquerors, Wicked Bloodline Extreme, Super Battle Road. I think all of these stages, this King Cold actually would be helpful um, for beating those stages, right? So I, I do kind of like um, that they they made this guy like this, right? They, they gave him what I consider a clearly defined purpose. I like that, right? When they actually make these characters have like, like some point to them. Um, okay, so let's fully EZA him. Um, let me, I'll, I'll level him up, we'll get on the max SA in a second right here, um, and then I will come back, we'll collect all the missions, uh, I'll go ahead and link level this guy, um, and then we can test him out and see how good the King Cold is, but no matter what, I feel like he, he will be handy, maybe some battlefield stages, and definitely Super Battle Road. Alright, bam, King Cold is completed, there we go, so now we've got all of these links, we're gonna have to go ahead and grind up another character to link level, yes! All right, so we should have um, all of the missions completed right here. So let's just go ahead and grab all these missions, and then we'll finish up. Um, so let me know what you guys are thinking about the, you know, this new sort of uh, Super Strike grind format that they've created. I think it's fine, right? In Android 16, I found very helpful. Um, this King Cold, I think, could be pretty useful. So they are making some of these characters actually, like, decent, which, which is certainly helping, right? I think as long as they just, like make them good in a specific type of stage or on a specific team or something like that that's it but you know let summonable characters could be good everywhere every stage blah 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 blah. but like they could make good free-to-play units that could help in certain type of events and i think they did do that with this king cold so that's good um so there's all the missions done um again let me know what you guys are thinking of this bad boy uh thanks for watching um and i'll catch y'all next time